In traditional times, the Ghana people of Adelaide Plains dined on kangaroo tail as a part of their diet. Hunting and gathering is a big part of traditional lifestyle and was accompanied by ceremonial dancing and singing. There are many ways to cook and prepare kangaroo tail for consumption. The popular way was to cook the whole kangaroo, but today we'd just be cooking the tail. Kangaroo tail can be prepared in many different ways. The Ghana people, as well as many indigenous groups throughout Australia, would cook the tail in a fire pit. To prepare the fire pit, a suitable size hole was dug in the earth. In some instances, stones were used to line the pit. The Ghana people would have to use river stones because they are around and smooth. Most campsites were around or near the rivers. The stones were used in the bottom of the pit to conserve the heat. Suitable wood was collected. Today we have to be careful not to use wood that has been treated. Small pieces of wood such as bark was put on top of the stones and the large pieces were stacked on top. The fire was then lit and allowed to burn down to hot coals. Using a stick a hollow would be scraped in the coals. In traditional times the skin would have been left on. Today we are going to cook some with the skin on too. The kangaroo tail would then be placed into the hollow. The coals that have been pushed aside are then scraped back over the tails to ensure they were thoroughly cooked through. The coals were then scraped off and the tails pushed aside to cool. Once ready the skin would be removed quite easily leaving a nice clean piece of meat ready for consumption. We hope you have enjoyed this film and gained an understanding of how Aboriginal people, and in this instance, the Ghana people, used to cook kangaroo tail in the traditional way.